my name is Robert Reig. Um, I was a firefighter on 9 11 and was critically injured. And I'm here at the proceedings at Fort Hamilton. Um, I, I wanted to see the case uh, make progress towards us finally achieving justice and show my support for the other families and, uh, and, and for the prosecution team and the military commissions. I'm just somber. We're just watching. I found that the defendants were somewhat more cooperative than last time. Uh, when we last attended, they refused to even wear the, the, uh, the earplugs where they could listen simultaneous translation. This time they did. When the judge asked them questions, they cooperated and answered the questions. So there, there weren't quite as many delays. Um, some of the questions, like for, for a bystander, seemed like very lengthy discussions, which is tedious. Uh, for, for I, I think they'll be far more interesting once the actual trial starts. We're going to persevere. We want justice. I, uh, many of my brother firefighters I was with that day were killed. Uh, I saw met numerous people jump from the upper floors. You know, I'll be scarred by that memory for the rest of my life, and I, I want to see justice. If I have to torture myself coming down here <laughs> with four or five hours in traffic, I will. And I, I can't make it every day, but I, I thought the, the opening day was uh, primary importance. We're here to represent our, our, our families. I lost, uh, my wife and I lost our son Keith, who's a paramedic. Uh, it's important for us to be here to uh, continue his, uh, his legacy, if you want, or uh, his memory. Uh, we're his voice. Uh, we sat through seven weeks of the Musali trial. Uh, we have been to Guantanamo Bay already, uh, so it, it's important. We, we got to be there for them. We felt that we had to be Keith's voice, and you know somebody should be held accountable for what's happened. Um, I won't go into politics, but uh, <laughs> Americans ha are inherently they have a right and wrong. And when somebody does it wrong, they want somebody to be accountable for it. And I want these people to be accountable for it. 